everyone, I'm back. Um, last when we left off, we were talking to Doc Mitchell about letting us uh, get some medical supplies off of him. And last time I checked, I think that was the last thing I had to do. Because I can't seem to get um, Easy Pete to give up his dynamite. So we are going to go head up here. I tried to change my weapon, because I'm pretty sure I know it's coming in the future. Um, I believe that we gotta go talk to Ringo again. So, we can get this underway. I just realized that the iron sights is a screw. Anyways, let's go in here, talk to Ringo, see if he's ready to fight. Ringo, how you doing, buddy? Hey, don't go into a corner. Oh. Thirsty, I guess. So what's going on? Did Sonny agree to help us? Sonny's with us. Well, I guess that means we're ready to go. Unless you think there's something else you can do. No, let's do this. All right, I'm ready. I hope. Let's go. Time to look alive. The powder gang is scared the fight. shit out of me. How many are there? At least six. Joe Cobb included. They look pretty mean. Y'all are making a big fuss. About six people. I'll be set up near the store. Let's hope that the gang doesn't manage to make it that far. Oh, don't worry, sweet cheeks. They won't. We're gonna go rough them up a little bit. Alright. Let's go. Y'all ready facts? I am. Y'all run... Why y'all run faster than me? Is it... Oh. It's because of the gun. That would make more sense. Alright, y'all. Stay close. Don't pull a Dan, okay? I'm gonna go rough these ruffians up. Oh! Oh! Hello. Can I, uh, can I see you in my office? Uh oh. Oh shit. Okay. Uh, how do I... How do I put this... How do I put stim packs on my... Is it one? Yeah. That should do for now. I'll just hit one if I need it again. Hold still, fucko. Thank you. I gained karma. Noise. Joe Cobb's man. Bad bombing. It's fine by me. I'm shunned by the powder gangers. Well, I'm liked by them though. I'm hated by the powder gangers. Okay. Come here. I want your revolver, your rounds. That sucks compared to my other stuff. I'll take your bottle caps in your case. Let's go, uh... No, what now? I owe you a huge favor for this. Here, these are technically Crimson Caravan funds, but I know they'll understand once I explain things. Um... You're welcome. I'll stick around for a bit longer, but I'll be gone in a few days. If you ever visit New Vegas, look me up at the Crimson Caravan camp. Alright, will do. Bye. What you got? Okay, 20 gauge rounds. I could use those. Ooh, dynamite. Uh, uh, nah, I'm good. Let's, uh, what do you have? A varmint rifle, 556 five, rounds. Oh, yeah, dynamite. I didn't see that. Okay. What do you have, good sir? Did you add shit? What did you have? 20 gauge rounds. Dynamite. I'm good with that. I probably don't give a damn about what you have. Why oh, is your bottle cap? That helps. Hey, Easy Pete, are you dead? He's not in his chair. Easy. Easy. Hey. What? You're alive! Bastard. 
Okay, um, let's check the map. Where do we need to go? Uh, quests. We need to track down the source of the Sierra Madre investigation. They went that away. Alright, we will go to Prim. So, um, I don't know if that was... I wish I could have been able to use a dynamite. That would have been a little bit more helpful, but... Yeah, well, you know how it goes. Old people never want to help out us young folks. I'm sorry, my finger itched. Um, get an itchy trigger finger, if you know what I mean. Um, it didn't take me to the road towards the death claws. Oh, no, not not at all. Okay, let's go ahead and head to Prim. It's going to be a long walk. I'm going to go ahead and cut this out. I'll be right back. Ah, oh, great. It wasn't recording. Fuck! <laughs> okay, let me explain again. My computer messed up. I had trouble recording. Screen kept flickering and shutting off. My recording software just messed up now. And it wasn't recording. So let's re let's, let's re-clarify. I went, I traveled to Prim. I had met a few powder gangers on the way. I walked in here, and I started talking to this man, this fine fellow right here named Johnson Nash. And he's letting me know about the people who gave me a package. What is strange about the package that the viewers probably don't know about? That cowboy robot had us hire six couriers. Each was carrying something a little different. A pair of dice, chess piece, that kind of stuff. Last word I have in the office, it looked like payment had been received for the other five jobs. Guess it was just your chip that didn't make it. First deadbeat we hired to do the job, canceled. Hope a storm from the divide skins him alive. Well, that's where you came in. Why did your lip flicker when you breathed out? I don't know. He canceled. Yeah, I got this look when he saw you next down on the courier list. His expression turned right around. Asked me if your name was for real. I said, sure as lack of rain, you were still kicking. Then he turned down the job, just like that. I asked if he was sure it was good money. No, but Courier 6 carried the package. That's what he said. Like the Mojave sort you out or something. Then he just up and walked out. Well, that sounds like a damn shame. Do you know who he was, where he went? No idea. Sounds like you two had a history for him to act like that. And turn down the money, too. Hope he didn't see any trouble in that package of yours. Maybe he thought your name was bad luck. Not enough for me to say. Some men stole my package. A man in a checkered suit and some thugs. Did they pass this way? Well, now that you mentioned it, a few nights back, one of the townies was out scavenging for supplies. He said he saw a fellow with a daisy suit come through with some of them great con misfits. They was talking about a chip. One of the men shot me. How do you know the best way to get to them? Well, for that, your best bet is going to be talking to Deputy Beagle. Since they came to town, he was keeping a good bit of notes on them, and he was slinking around Bison Steve when your pretty boy friend came through. He may have heard where they were going. Um, goodbye. Don't go getting yourself shot. Now that I can't promise you, my good friend. Uh, let's, let's explore around here a little bit. Yeah. Let me turn the flashlight on, it's too dark. There we go. Okay. Ooh, can I go in? Oh, it's, that's right, it's stealing if I go in there. Oh. Shh. How do you do it again? There we go. Let's go get some things. Give me some money too. Okay, uh, where'd you go? Where'd you go? Oh. So many safes and I can't open them? Oh. Motherfuck. Come on. There we go. Oh, I got bottle caps. 
Sunset, sarsaparilla, pre-war money, dirty water. Uh -uh. Ah! Okay, um... Speech to 40. Lockpick to 40. Guns. Oh, that's right. Oh! I'll take that. I'll take that. I guess I'll take that. Ah, fuck. Ooh. I'm not a bad guy, I promise. I just... I eat free shit. Crap! Ah! Uh. Shit! You don't have to come in here. We could be friends. Ah, crap. Okay. Okay. We're just, uh... Gonna forget that ever happened. I don't know what it was. Okay, I already know. I already know. Bye-bye. Alright. Oh, no. I have to talk to you. You don't want to give me the info. Come back. Hey, youngster. Still... Yeah. Oh, okay, okay. Okay, I get it, I get it. Alright. Oh. I don't want to get myself shot. I already got myself shot in here. I don't need that again. I'm going to get myself shot out here, but that's not the point. Uh, let's see here. Let's, uh... Come on. Come on. Frame dropped a little bit. We'll be alright. Okay, um... I need to go this way. I couldn't jump a light post. Oh, I'm sorry, you couldn't walk over it. Let's equip another gun. Gun should we use? Uh, why not? I'm gonna put you away for right now. Oh, I gotta free him. That's right. Bison Steve Hotel. I wonder why it's called Bison Steve. Oh, hey, hold your fucking horses. I'm back, you son of a bitch. you got. I'll take your money, I'll take your rounds, take your bottle caps. Uh, dynamite. Dirty water. Hey, time out a second. Still can't see that well. 
Jeez. No. Not help. The kind of help I need you can't give me. Ah. I can see a little better, I guess. Hold on. Yeah, whatever. I'll take your money, your rounds, bottle caps. Oh, pork and beans. Hi there. This is hopeless. What is? Now wait, wait, now wait. Oh, you're a bad guy, anyways. Uh oh. Hey, excuse me. Oh, come on. There. Okay. Hello. Excuse me. Hello. Come I can die. Why are you running like a little bitch? <laughs> oh, right in the face. Okay. I need to repair that. Come back here. Chimpy, come back. I need to lick you. Oh, hello. I'll take your money. Oh wait, you still got a stim pack. Let me repair this. Uh... There we go. Maybe if I just uh Yeah, I have both little rounds for it, I didn't even notice that. Oh! Now wait, you wait. Now you wait just a cotton pick a minute here. I don't like your attitude. Oh, you know that's right, boo. Oh shit, that's command prompt. <laughs> Whoopsie. Hey, I leveled up again. A little bit more. Uh, um, I would carry you if you didn't weigh so much. Actually, you know what? I can sell that. Oops. I, okay. Uh, let's uh, let's go release uh, this little fellow over here. I'm trying to search these these people over here. Five rounds, eight ball caps, dynamite. Oh, they got. Huh? What? Oh. Okay. Uh. What's up? I don't suppose you came here to rescue me. I'd cross my fingers, but my hands are numb. I'm here to rescue you. You must be Deputy Beagle. Why, yes, I am. It's a pleasure to meet you. I'm in a bit of a predicament here. I'd be most appreciative if you'd set me free. Um. You may have some information on cons. Indeed, I do, good sir. And I would be thrilled to share that information with you as soon as I am released from captivity. No need to rush on my account. It would be so ah. delightful if you set me free. It'd be so very delightful. Oh, that's just marvelous. I think I'll be making my way... Oops. Oh, why, uh, of course. Damn it! I fucked up. That's okay though. Don't need none of that booze. Booze ain't food.